Okay, uh, we're looking at a sweep single here. And uh, we're gonna start sweep single at the two on one wrist tie. Uh, so Colin has Matt's wrist with uh, two hands. And again, remember you pull the leg toward you that you wanna attack. So Colin wants to attack Matt's left leg, so he's gonna pull that toward him. Notice as he pulls, he circles a little bit, and now he's gonna shoot his sweep single. Sweep single, freeze position. No, stay around in front, just a little, yeah, good. Okay, notice position here. Notice uh, Colin's inside knee is down, his back leg is up. Notice Colin's head is up. Notice his shoulder is over top of his knee, so he has vertical alignment with his shoulders and his, and his knee. He's in a good, strong position here. His arms are around Matt's leg. Okay, now, uh, keys here when he's gonna finish. Number one, he has to drive into Matt. Uh, if Matt puts all his weight on his left leg, Matt, put your weight on your left leg, then Colin can't pick that up because there's too much weight on it. So Colin wants to drive into Matt so that the weight goes on Matt's back leg. Okay, see that? So you gotta drive in as you pick the leg up. As you drive in, you keep your body straight, you keep your head up. Once you drive in and drive up, you get the leg up, now you wanna clear the leg to the outside. So you want it outside. Notice when he clears outside, he's gonna get the leg high. It's in his elbow. He's gonna take his fist and put it on his chest, and he's gonna walk his hips into Matt, like that. So this is good, strong position for Colin here. Now there are two big finishes here for Colin. One is Colin can take his outside hand and grab uh, Matt's knee, and now he's gonna shuffle and chop his feet in a circle and take Matt down. Okay, once he finishes, once Matt hits the mat, uh, Colin doesn't fall down with him. Colin stays up above him, and Colin is looking for pinning combinations. He's looking to pick up the bottom leg navy. He's looking to maybe jump sides and shoot a half Nelson. He's looking to grab a wrist. You know, all kinds of things could be there. So he's alert and he's aware. Okay, let's see that skill again. So we're two on one. Pull the leg toward us, sweep single, drive up into him, pick the leg up high, finish and then looking for back points or some control. The other finish that Colin can do here is instead of going for the knee, he can go for Matt's uh, uh, collar. Watch how it looks, same set, coming up. Now instead of going at the knee, Matt's gonna go to Matt, Matt's, or Colin's gonna go to Matt's neck. Same kind of thing though. He's gonna take his feet and he's gonna chop in a circle backwards. He always wants Matt to go fall backwards. And then again, looking for to pick up some pieces here to score. Okay. On a sweep single, just like a double leg, sometimes your partner is going to sprawl. So what's our answer when he sprawls? Let's see what happens. Okay. Uh, we're going to pull the wrist, we get the sweep single, partner sprawls. Again, from this position, Colin is, is in bad position. Uh, he's extended, his arms are up over his head and he's weak, uh, his shoulder and knee alignment is lost. Right. This is not good for Colin, this is good for Matt. Matt wants to keep Colin's head down. What Colin wants to do is get himself mobile. So he's gonna pop up on his toes. He's gonna turn the corner immediately. Bang, he's gonna keep the front knee with his inside his front hand, and he's gonna go backhand reach. He's gonna drive in and through Matt and keep his legs moving as he turns the corner. Okay, let's see that again. We're going sweep single. Sweep single, partner sprawls. We're gonna get on our toes, turn the corner, backhand reach. Let's see that one more time from the opposite angle. This is real common and we don't want kids to be afraid to shoot. Uh, one of the things that kids will run into is they're afraid to shoot because partners sprawl and they don't know what to do. Here's what they need to do. Okay, sweep single, attack and finishes.